Uh, Guru is not here with us right now, um, and I'm gonna be okay. You can voice over can these this. guys. You, yeah, you can do this segment. Yep. And then you've got gameplay off. coming up, and then so uh, I'm just going to ultimate team. Ultimate here. team. All right. And if you want to leave your mic, I will do that. I'm gonna be a one man wrecking crew right now until we get the guys on. Farls, put your mic over here. Dun da da da. Do we have the other mic? Yeah, it's right over here. We're gonna just leave him on the couch. Mic at the shirt. Okay. Then on mute. Yep. So where's where's the other one? Right here. Right there. Okay. That's the one that's causing the most problems. Okay. So. Okay. That's well. Well, let's monitor it if it gets. We have four total, right? Yeah. Okay. So if that one, if that, so right now, guys, we're about we're, we're monitoring this mic. If it gets into a situation where we take it away. We will take away one of the mics. So, here's here's what I'll do. Uh, so, Billy, you want to take here? Hey, okay. Is that good? Is that a good spot for you? Yeah. All right. Uh, you guys are good to come on. Just come on home. Come on in. Come on in. All right. Yep. Any mic? In the house. Right, let me see if this is. You, you no are longer muted. You are no longer muted. I'm mute. I'm not muted now. Hello, hello. Well, yep, I'm you're muted. good. You're good. All right, so Joe, we're just switching over here, guys. Microphones and whatnot. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, everyone in the chat. Billy, Billy, Billy. Billy. How does that make you feel, man? Uh, How does that make you feel? It's all right. Huh? Yeah. It's a, it's a <laughs> you guys are hurting his feelings. Few, I got a few years to catch are, up. To that's Billy. signed. That's a lot of good stuff right there. That's all the rookies. What? Yeah. Pretty sweet. We're gonna give that away too. All right. To us. To me. Yeah. You want? Well, <laughs> we'll we'll have it. If you guys want to play a match at the end, we can we can decide. That's who gets it. But. That's it. All right. So I'm gonna give you guys the magic paddles here. You guys are gonna run Let's through. Go. So. First and foremost, guys, introduce yourselves. Tell us who you are, what you do. I know people are super excited. This is, I mean, when I say we've been live all day, they've been asking for you guys. So we're super excited to have you on here. So let's start down the line. Tell me a little bit about yourself. How's it going, guys? I'm Christian, uh, aka Pixel Pusher. I am the guy responsible for all the art you see. Uh, mutt items, uh, packs, all the good stuff. So that's, uh, that's what I do. <laughs> all right. Uh, I'm Joel Reed. Uh, people have been watching all day. I've been on. I was on earlier uh, talking about Madden Mobile, and uh, I tend to work on all the, uh, basically all the all the stuff that you see that goes on in all the games uh, on both Mutt and on Madden Mobile. Uh, that you see the, the new live events and the new Soul Challenge, all the stuff we do every day on, on both games. So that's why I'm here to talk about these guys. All right, Billy. Yeah, Joseph, we're busy. Uh, I'm Billy. Uh, Shouts four seven. You already know. Um, I am an associate producer. That's what I am. Yeah, that's what I do. And a game designer. And I help create, choose players, choose their OVRs. You guys might hate the decision on these OVRs, but yes, they come from me for the most part. Um, yeah, I create players and help create uh, the weekly designs. All right. So, guys, introduction. I know you already know who they are, but let's get into it. Let's just jump right into the very first thing about Madden Ultimate Team this year. I, I think people want to talk about NFL Journey. They want to talk about what this is going to be like, what this experience is going to be like this year. They had all these solo challenges in the year past. Now they have NFL Journey, a distinct difference. What is that? Yeah, so I think, I think what happen, what's happened in the past is that people play solo challenges, and, and actually when we talk to, to players about it, they, it's just a full game after full game, and it's, it's kind of a, um, it's a longer experience. I think the super exciting part about it this year is that it's no longer just a full game. Um, you'll help, we have scenarios set up, so actually... Um, uh, Billy's got, got it up here. Uh, I'm sure we'll go into it here in a minute, but just kind of like the first uh, NFL Journey Solo Challenge you'll play, you'll play is recreating the Super Bowl 49, where you're going to be at the two yard line or I don't know what the happened yard line. You, 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 um, yeah. you score a touchdown, you go in, it's a super short scenario, super short, super short win. So it's not just playing the same game and going through the same motions over and over again. There's different different types of scenarios you're going to put you in. Sometimes you'll need to score with two minutes left. Sometimes you'll just need to kick a field goal. Sometimes you'll need to stop the opponent from scoring. Um, all sorts of cool like stuff like that. And there's what, how many of these things are there? We made it. 160. There's 160 of them in at, at, at launch. So there's a ton of stuff for people to play through. It's going to be really, really exciting. Can I play one of these? Yeah, absolutely. You can definitely play. Uh, uh, 
So when Let's you, go. You, you're going to jump into this Bills one, what's really cool is that you can kind of predict or you can uh, determine the scenario that you want, which I think that's really cool. When you first start up Madden Ultimate Team, your first one that you go into is that Patriots or Seahawks one. That's super cool. You can get the rewrite history for that. So, uh, yeah, jump into this game here real quick uh, and, and talk about a little bit about what you can uh, expect coming up for this year in terms of uh, content that will be coming out. I know everyone kind of has what has happened in the past and what can you talk about what you've done in the past what you want to do in the future first first whose name is automatics that's this is this is mike's team this okay. is my team okay. this is my team okay. he would with, with the browns with the Graham browns. auto is not in madden this year i'm just letting everybody know that okay okay automatics come on now come that's on, right Mike. The other thing here, guys, so what we have here, we do have our first official, we have the tweet up for EA Access, the five codes. So what I'm going to do, your chance to win, you have to go to this tweet and retweet it for a chance. I'm going to put the link in the Very chat looks sick. so that you guys can go ahead and, and send this tweet out uh, for a shot to win uh, EA Access code. So here we go. I better not One blow this game. One second. <laughs> there's a lot of pressure. I know. There's, there's, there's a lot of pressure. Really. All right, Billy. Well, no, no pressure, Billy. You just, just don't let who's the QB? All of Who the you got? On na <laughs> a national live internet, you know, no big deal. <laughs> Who you got a QB? Uh, this is McFadden's team, man. I don't know. I, I, my, my team, I had uh, I had Joe Flacco. Okay. So let me send this tweet in the chat, guys. So what we need you to do again is go over to this link, retweet this for a chance. We'll pick five people that will have a shot that will win this EA access code. So right here. So, let's go. so you're down by six with 20 seconds left from the 10. So you basically got to score on. Yeah. Another really, goals. another really big plays. thing to let everybody know is that um, when you come into these games, you have to be, be paying attention because as soon as you enter the game, the game clock will start running. You should hop on a play as soon as you can. I've had multiple cases. Oh no! Ooh. Oh man! All right, all right, all right. Ooh. Everybody, he dropped the D end. It's okay. Do you want to hand me the stick? I wasn't ready. All right, <laughs> let me go. All right, let me try one more time, and then you can you can own that sure. fourth down. Okay. Yeah, 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 hold on. All right. All right, Billy. All right, no, no pressure. Just a lot of pressure. <laughs> all right, hold up. Look at these uniforms. These are pretty sweet. Okay. Let's go. Crib. Oh. Nice. All right. So there, there you, you are. Nice so, so basically, scenario completed. So in this situation, though, Ballin. you start. What's what's the uh, level you start on on these first NFL? Define journeys? what you mean by level. Well, you're you're the you're so all mad. Say all mad and all pro. Yeah. So you pro, they, rookie, they start right? off super easy. Like right. They'll be rookie difficulty yeah. at first, and then as you get into as you get deeper into them, they'll they'll get harder and harder as you go through. Well, that's that's super cool. I think a lot of people are gonna have a lot of fun with that. It's gonna there's so much for you to do right off the bat, which is really cool. That's that's what's most important, I think, to these guys out here. So unless you really really mess this one up. You should get out of here with the George W. Yeah, I could, I could mess it up though, for sure. Oh, oh. All right, everybody, yeah. everybody, come down. Time off the clock. That's okay. Look, we're up by one. <laughs> it's all good. We're safe. We're, we're straight. We just need Joe, a better. Joe, let me see that control right there behind you. Yeah. Let me see it. Let's see if this thing is active. Let's see. Oh, here we all go. All right. So, te hey, tech guys, yeah. uh, we, we're gonna pull up some packs on the other screen. That we'll be able to rip packs at the same time while Billy's grinding through this uh, NFL journey I challenge here, it and because uh, we got packs on top of packs over here. We need that. Uh, after we got seven seconds, let's let him finish out his game, and then I want to. I'm going to give the the uh, the pro pack bundle magic here to Mr. Joe, and I, I this is my this is my team. I, I need your luck. All right. I need your pro pack luck. Oh, please please left. provide oh, me the luck. I need some elites. I've, I've pulled like six elites so far today with my packs that I've pulled. So I'm super excited about that. I uh, got okay. Jarius Bird. I got uh, Carlos Dansby. Aqib Talib. So I got some guys. I got some guys in my squad. So I'm All pretty right, happy. We, got, we, got a, we can't jinx Billy here, though. No, I don't want to do that. He's got it. He's got it. Come right? On. I think so. My D line's oh, definitely struggling. <laughs> Hey, caught it! Oh, caught it! Oh, You're good. You're good. You're good. Whatever, wow. game. Doesn't matter. Nice wow. Try. So, yeah. so that's a little sneak peek there. What you guys can expect from NFL Journey? You get these scenarios that you have to uh, go out and uh, accomplish to get the W here in this. We instance, briefly show them, show them the reward yeah. before we move over. Oh to the my packs. god! Absolutely. Um, absolutely. The important thing to know is that the first two, um, when you come into Madden, when you come into Mutt, uh, we're going to be sending you uh, right to the first solo challenge, which will be the NFL Journey Super Bowl like remake. Uh, the important thing to note, though, is after the games one and two, we're going to be rewarding you a pack that gives uh, style players. So, and a uh, little bit of an inside note, um, in your very first pack, you get silver, 65 overall, dry, dry archer. 
Okay, you want to start that dude immediately. Yes. Um, and by the way, pro screen, tip. yeah, pro, pro tip, pro tip. Absolutely. Start spread. dry archer as soon as you finish that first game. Um, and then run screens after screens on that with, with that guy. Nine, 96 wheels on that guy? 96? I think 96 speed, uh, 98 agility, right. and 92 acceleration. He is absolute stud muffin. But the absolute big, beast. The big takeaway is those first few challenges, you get some really nice rewards for somebody who's just new into the game, who's got maybe got a lot of bronze players, really some cool upgrades for you to get your team off the ground yeah. quickly. And, and as they go, it's I mean, it's going to get harder and it's going to be more difficult. So it's not like they're going to just breeze through it. I mean, yeah. they're going to get to a point where it's going to be like, I, this is actually fun for me to play because I'm getting some competition from the computer. And bro, update your style. Pick, pick your right style code. That's on, not yo. on me. That's not on me. That's that's on Come Makuru. On that's on Makuru. You have, a, you have to talk to him about that, Bill. Yeah, it's not me. It's all. One thing I think too in Journey is if you're if you're new to Mutt or Madden Ultimate Team, uh, you can you start. It's a great way to kind of get your feet wet, start ramping up into the harder difficulty games. If that's you're right. experienced, it's a great way to just go cash in on some easy rewards, start beefing up your team. Um, that's definitely the place I'm going to be starting. You can switch it. Uh, yeah, all right, so uh, let's switch over to the Odell Xbox, and we're going to rip some packs here. We are live, so let's go, Joe. Come on, some, I'm some totally pack happy. luck. Like, if, I, if I mess a few of these up, I'm totally just passing off to you. All right, so I got, I got some decent pack luck, so let's see. Let's so. It's, you just, let's, I know you got some magic in you, Joe. We'll see. So talk yeah. a little bit about, uh, so we had Brad on earlier today. Ooh, I got send it. So we had right. Brad on earlier today. So it, it, we see that the when you get the like if it's a gold, uh, if you get an elite item, we get a different flash here. So, uh, yeah. you know, can you talk a little bit about what you're seeing here, some of the GP new card out, and the what, what people can expect here moving forward this year? Yeah, definitely. I think a lot of the the reveal animation, something we thought about a lot. Uh, we wanted to make sure that there's. Uh, there's a clear visual indicator. If you got something that, that's exciting, uh, we wanted to make it as exciting for you. Um, and with it goes a lot of thought into uh, a, lot of these, uh, a lot of these items here. We've, we've redone some of the screenshots for the stadiums. Uh, we've, we've worked on, on getting some of those uniforms looking nice and sharp. Um, oh, so man. a lot goes into these items. No, this is this, this is, is great. great. This is actually great. This is great. This can is you great. can you do it? You got we, it. We have well, it. Right, this this so this happened earlier but, in the day, and it was a but, great segue into something that's really cool about Mutt. How Take many how many do we have left to quick sell? How many uh, can you quick sell at once? Correct. Uh, sure. First and foremost, I want to say this as as being a Mutt player. Twenty last year. The fact that this comes up and you're able to click a button and go directly to your item binder. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> because. It's so annoying. It was just before you had to be back out, back out, back out. Go. So it, it took time. And when you're playing mud all day, that everyone does, right? So it's it's difficult to do that. Now you have a button goes directly in. Oh man, go to twenty. You know what it reminded right. me of? Twenty click sell, right? People, no. uh, M25 will remember um, pending collections. Yep. I uh, I hated pending collections. So yeah. Wait, Joe, uh, how you, are you going through? I don't get it. Isn't it supposed to stop at 20? What, what are you pressing? What are you doing? Talk to the guys. Talk to the guys. Talk to the guys. Number, Joe. What's that number? Talk to the guys. Oh, Joe. That's a out of 100. Uh, it's out of 100. So you're saying he's keeping it 100, right? Yes. Now. All right. Joe, oh, Joe, I, see I swear. There. Keep Joe, keeping it 100. I see there. Joe, if you, if you get rid of my Cowboys defense, I will be very unhappy with you. Okay. Is that what you so. roll with? <laughs> that's Cowboys, Cowboys that's my defense. Okay. I like the defense. I like the Chargers offensive playbook. Pro tip, guys. Here's a pro tip for you when you're doing this quick sell. If you hit right trigger, so right here, Joe, hit right trigger. Now hit X. Now you go to type, go left, type. All players. Coach them up. Coach them up. All players. Let them know. No, 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 not all. All uh, go back type. It's okay, Joe. Down all players. Up, up, up. Right there. Now we get rid of these guys for for this uh, scenario. Right. If, if if we wanted to put them in sets and stuff like that, yes, we would save on uh, hold on to them. But in this scenario, we're just trying to quick sell a hundred of these guys. We're almost at a hundred now. This way, you're not going to get rid of playbooks. You're not going to get rid of anything you don't necessarily want in that regard. So I also, I know it's really easy when you're just ripping packs, ripping packs to just blow off all these bronze and silver guys. But there is a can I say hell? There's a lot of yeah. value. Yes, there's, a hell of, there's a hell of a lot of value. <laughs> In uh, in this in warehouse sets, so you can jump all of those bronze sil silver players if you're not using them into sets and earn plenty of rewards. Well, funny you say that, Billy, because I have a warehouse set open right now. So oh, can we head on over to on the, the Gronk Xbox. Screen, no. We're gonna head over to the Gronk Xbox. It is on the wrong screen, but we can uh, you can talk a little bit about. The oh, uh, can we go back to Odell? Go back Will to Odell. For Sorry, I didn't know that was gonna happen. That that's the magic luck of Joe. That's why I gave him the stick. That was like uh, what th four packs? That was nothing. So. 
I mean, tell the first thing I noticed about the the, the art. I here, never get that. The 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 red, right? Obviously, of the, on the corners, but when you look at the Texans, the Texans are red. So if say if you pulled like uh, the Packers, you pulled an Aaron Rodgers, the best quarterback in Mutt currently right now, ninety one right. overall. What color Arguable. shows there? Oh, you're gonna Argu start. Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna start seeing the team colors there. So uh, a lot of them are. Uh, you know, if you see Aaron Rodgers, it's going to be the, the Green Bay Green. Uh, you might pull a Miami Dolphins. It's going to be that aqua blue. Um, it's, it's really cool, I think, uh, especially in that loading screen when you're kind of heading into a game and it's showing off your best items. Uh, you get to see some cool, some cool art there. Show off some of your best players in your lineup. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, so we'll head back over to Gronk, uh, the Gronk Xbox. So you were talking about, uh, before Bill, you were talking about the, yeah, we named our Xboxes so that we'd have a, a chance to dif differentiate them. I see so, what you're doing there. Um, so I'm in the warehouse right now, and you were saying that you're going to have a lot of value in the warehouse. I, so say you're new to Mutt, which is crazy, right? You, who's new to Mutt? Mutt's Wild. awesome, right? Something, so you're new to crazy. Mutt. What is the warehouse? What are sets? What are, we, what are we doing here? Warehouse and sets in general are where you can add your um, any type of player collectible that's required in a certain collection. You can uh, place any type of silver or bronze player, any player for that matter, into a set and earn rewards back for it. Um, what he's showing right now is a good example. Um, this is the Bears Gold Collection. You're going to want to put all these, these specific gold Bears player into the set and you'll be able to get back... 10, a 10 badge pack with a chance at elite. Yeah, so when you're, you're opening packs and you get some stuff you don't want, like your stuff that you still get in there that you're not putting in your lineup is still super valuable because you can still use them for stuff like this. And uh, the, the guys you get for this sort of stuff is, is super mm -hmm. valuable too. So, Right, so, so, so what, that is, what, they're, what they're saying there, guys, is there's value in everything, right? You're being able to find value in everything and be able to... Let's see this briefly. Yeah, go ahead. Get in there. Get in on this. As a quick breakdown, um, this is the, the, the best place to put... All right, so here we go. Stadiums, you want all your extra bronze stadiums you put in here. Uniforms, blah, 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 blah. But in my opinion, at least when you're starting, you want to dump your bronze and silver players here, potentially. If you're not using them, bronze and silver players will go in these multiple team sets. But where you want to place your team golds... <laughs> A set that you can complete more than once. You can do it over and over and over again as, for as long as it's available. Um, stadiums are going to be up forever. You can do them over and over and over again. You can keep getting the same reward over again. However, captain sets, these are the much more rewarding ones. These are one and done deal. So in my opinion, at least what the first month, uh, you, get a, you get a gold player of any, any type of um, team. I would add them to this set, captain set. Out of this, you can get a 90 overall Kyle Long player for the Bears one. They all they vary. I know a lot of you guys have been on Mudhead, seeing all a lot of different players being revealed, and as well as with our blogs going out. But uh, I'm gonna run through these. Browns fans, Mutt Guru would be very happy right now. It's Sean Gibson. Can we get into any insight of maybe who you think the best captains might be? Because I know I mean we're going through through them now. Like, is there any particular one that is your favorite? Maybe just a favorite player, or you, you know, I like middle linebackers, I like outside linebackers, or anything like that. Uh, Anyone in particular? Not really. I mean, I, I have I have cap on my team up upstairs, but uh, I don't know. Hold on, there's one other one that's really that's really that's really sick. No. Oh, he's all right. <sighs> Stud right there. <laughs> Stud. Ninky, Rob Ninkovich. Matt Stafford, you know he's going to have good throw power. Yeah, big he has good throw arm. power. He has a lot of good, uh, his, his throw accuracy deep is pretty serious. And that'll play big into, uh, into Madden this year. Yeah, I don't know. For the most part, you want to put your gold players in these sets at launch. Maybe when we get down the road and we hit, oh, Texans captain. Anybody else watch Hard Knocks? Can I yeah, just say yeah, that? Yeah, yeah say absolutely. That? absolutely. Right, I don't know anything. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, Hard Knocks. That was awesome last night. Yeah, so let's go, go back into the Texans captain here, cl click into it, and so again, you're going to have, it's the same number of golds for every team, is that correct? Uh, yes. So, so and how many, roughly is it, it's like, was it 10, or is it... God, I want to say it's math? something like 18, 19? 18, 19, so yeah, so you have this same number of golds you're going to have to put in, now there's other parts uh, that you have to put in here, so there's a couple elites too, correct? Okay, so a, a quick breakdown is, um, each captain set's going to uh, require about, I'm, I'm, don't quote me on this, about 18 gold players from that specific team. It's going to require one elite player from that specific team. 
And then, this is where it gets a little tricky, so here we go. Uh, two elite badges. Elite badges uh, can be earned through seasons play. If you get them in a badge pack, they could be earned in uh, warehouse sets. If you complete them, they give you badge packs and there's a potential uh, chance to get these elite badges. But the newest thing to captain sets this year are these bad boys right here, captain tokens. These are earned throughout NFL Journey. So when you finish your very first level of NFL Journey, I'm going to back out here and go back yeah. and go over to it. Please when do. you finish your very f uh, an issue with last year was regular season, our regular season format with solo challenges for those who are played 25 and 15. Um, was our format was to play 12 ish long solo challenges to get to pick one person. You had to unlock multiple levels. You had to get to the elite stage and uh, play that solo to have a chance to get the collectible to go to the player. Anyway, you had to pick a team. It was too much. You had to pick a team. Yeah. Um, and stick with it the whole time for the whole their whole regular season journey. Uh, the whole regular season. Um, this time, you complete every few games, you're going to get a NFL Journey Captain Token. Um, one is given out right here, I, I believe. Okay. So basically, all you have to do to get your hands on those is, is play Journey games. Like, it's that simple. Yeah. Like, it's not... You should have you're, two you're Captain be... You should have two Captain Collectibles after playing just the prospect level of Journey. Yeah. The so... Ju the, the NFL Journey is such an intricate part of, of MUT this year, like you're, you're, there's plenty of reasons to do it and, and get involved with it for, for the rewards and the, 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 captain, the captain tokens are just another, another element to it all. All right, we're going to go back into the captain set and be like, I want you to scroll one, one, one by one, all right, and I want the chat, as you see these, type one in the chat for your favorite captain. Do you like a, the Bears captain? Type one. Do you like the Bengals captain? Type two. Personally, right now, I think that Leon Hall here, he, I, I would take him over the offensive lineman, and, and he's going to be a corner that's going to shut down on the outside. He's going to be an absolute stud, and I, I think he's going to be a, a super big-time uh, player for people when they're building their teams. I would go after this guy right here, f first and foremost. So we got one in the chat already, so they're and saying I would the argue captain. against you. Really? Really? Out of these two, I'd probably go with, uh, I'd probably go with this guy, Kyle Long, just because his strength and run block power is pretty, pretty damn good. Yep. And the running game is pretty strong this year, especially if you have a if you have a bruising uh, running back. But two totally different types of p people, two totally different types of fit, and two totally different types of systems. Um, yeah. I don't want to play you. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, no worries, uh, no worries. And I don't want to play you in real life either. So uh, we're that's like we're totally even. We're totally deal. square. Um, so yeah, uh, Cass, can you tell me a little bit about some of the pack art here, or some or some of the item art? Uh, do you have a favorite that you've done for these captains? Because these guys get different treatments, just like the elites get different treatments. Do you have a favorite here right. that you've done? Um, it's tough. There's there's a lot of them. Um, I put a lot of thought into each one. Uh, a lot of thought goes into just picking the right image. As you can tell, these are cut out. But when we're selecting images, there's a lot that we go through and just selecting the right poses. I like action. I what, like it, what do you go? What, tell us about that. Yeah. So, I mean, there's a lot. There's There's... Obviously, throughout the course of a game, the, the higher name guys, the bigger name guys, like a Kaepernick's going to have plenty of photos. So it's always finding the right one where, where someone's not wrapping him around. And sometimes we find the right image where you might have a guy in the middle of a tackle and I have to go in there and Photoshop their hand out, replace their jersey. Um, but we do everything we can to get the right oh, shot. That's a cool and one. I think the, the right image is what sets the art up to look really cool. Absolutely. Um, so that's actually step one in, in what it goes to a lot of this is really uh, finding the right image. Um, right here, uh, I do like Alfred Morris. Um, yeah, big shout out to Alfred Morris. He comes yeah. in here. Yeah, we, we, uh, we're big fans. Uh, He's I, a I huge do like, Mutt fan. I also really like the colors here. Redskins, uh, they're fun to work on. So. Oh, Oof. that was fresh. That Oof. was fresh. My favorite all-time oh. my favorite all -time I forgot item about him. is the Patriots... Tom Brady, where I, I, it might have been Super Bowl last MVP. year, where he was going, he was like, ah, oh, that was that's the that MVP was my favorite one. one. That was my favorite that's one. That's awesome. I've ever definitely seen. not a Homer pick. No, no, <laughs> definitely not it, a Homer pick. Never not really, not really, but sorta, but but sorta. So, uh, great work here. I know. I mean, it's one of the things that people talk about the most is is when new items come out and they love looking at everything, all the all the art and seeing what's happening there. So it's it's totally cool to kind of learn a little bit about how that happens. Definitely, and big shout out to the graphics community that's out on Twitter. Uh, they're always making custom cards, recreating a lot of these templates, and it's a lot of fun. I always go through a lot of them, even if I don't respond. I, I get a lot of stuff sent to me, but uh, it's all looking awesome, and it's it's a fun part of my job to to share that excitement for for making art. So, 
Cool. All right, we're switching gears here. Going to go into the vault. I don't know how much. I don't know how much you guys have done going around, but I'm just going to talk through Please. what you see here. Please. Um, like we mentioned before, badges. For those who don't know, um, badges is a different kind of form of like currency, and you can upgrade. You can use them to earn rewards or upgrade them to a higher level of badge. So these are all. These three are just upgrades. But then we get into the good stuff. Uh, flashbacks. Um, that's flashbacks, the good stuff. Yeah, that's the good stuff. That's flashbacks good have stuff. been around for like since what? Thirteen? I haven't been here at thirteen. Thirteen. <laughs> uh, we brought them back last year. We made it a weekly thing. This uh, at launch, it's not going to be a weekly thing. It'll just be this pack. We'll uh, readdress that later on, see if it's necessary. But some of these guys in here are pretty sick. Um, but yeah, flashbacks are big. Contracts. This is back. What? What? How do you determine what what a, what a flashback player is? So flashback players are they're basically players who had like awesome years in the past. So. I don't know. You got an example. They're also usually, head. they're also usually on different teams. Like yep. Sean Jackson on the Eagles in 2010. Right. He is one. Of, yeah, there you go. Oh, there he is, right there. There you go. Nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Look at Sean that. How that worked out. That, exactly. Yeah. So like, for those that not aren't seeing that on the screen, we actually says in the writing it says Deshaun Jackson underneath flashback. So that's what we're uh, talking about there. A uh, cool thing. Cool note. Last year, um, the lowest OVR guy was oh my god, was it Carson Palmer? Anyway. Totally hear you. You guys hate him. He was the most common. Pulling a quarterback who can't run, isn't mobile, can't throw deep is not ideal. So this year's lowest OVR uh, flashback guy is Ted Ginn with, don't quote me on this, it's like 97 speed. Is that good? So, that good? therefore, speed kills. That make you guys even happy? if, even you, if happy? you miss, <laughs> it's still a pretty valuable player that will sure as hell will help your team out. I hope that makes you guys happy. All right? Lot of, look at that. They listen to you. That's amazing. Listen to me? Yeah, they listen to you. Look at right. that. Or, or you listen to them. Wheel of contracts. Oh, speaking of contracts. Yep. Um, I, 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 won't, I won't go all the way back. I won't go all the way back. But know that every, um, God, what is it, every like eight games or so, an NFL journey is going to give you 100 contracts. So important. That's so important. Yeah, we found out that people were, I mean, obviously these are very short instances and they still, the NFL journey games are very short uh, experiences, but we still take contracts in most cases. So we want to be sure you're not like you're not running through just the first few games and not be able to play anymore. We want to provide you as much contracts as possible, at least at least to the first few uh, few first few levels. Absolutely. So keep, yeah, keep running through here. I'm gonna do some quick sells on my Xbox. Keep talking about what we have here. My favorite thing ever in the vault: large quick sell. For real. Right. So there's two ways in life that you know that you're a human being, that you know you're alive. Right. <laughs> One is when you drop your cell phone. And it's laying on the ground, and you have to determine: I'm going to pick it up, and is it broken or is it not broken? That moment that's in rough. time, it's is not broken rough. until you pick it well, up. Well, right. I mean, that's <laughs> that. That's how you know that you have feelings. Is that because that moment is just so nerve wracking, right? Absolutely. The only other time in life that you know that you're a human is when you do a large, uh, you do a large quick sell because it could be anything until you do it, right? It could be. It oh, just. Could, it's so nerve wracking, and, and I love. I love it. I'm addicted to it. I wish we could do it right now. It'd be great. Uh, this is cool. Okay, so yeah, large quick sell, small quick sell. Um, the difference of this is basically how many uh, items you have to require are required for it, and the potential height of the coin reward you can get. Premium playbooks and stadiums. This has been combined. Um, last year it was premium alternates, and everything had a, had a potential chance to get something. This is now just alternate playbooks and alternate stadiums, so you have a higher chance of pulling something you actually want. That's great. For all my uh, my guys out there that play with the 46 playbook, multiple D, all that stuff. So that's cool for those guys. Yeah, these are uh, badge to player upgrades, and this goes a little deeper into some DC stuff. Should we even go on that? Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's all cool stuff. Draft champions, right there. Take guys. it away. You, you hand off to me. Take hand it, away. it off. Yeah. So there's there's a couple things. So basically, for every uh, draft champions uh, match you win, you'll get a a draft champions badge that you can use within MUT to get all sorts of cool stuff. So the super easy win that you, you, you'll be able to get your hands on is by winning 10 Draft Champions games is the double elite player pack that you see here. And this basically, this earns you two elite players to get your ultimate team started. So it's Ooh. super cool. Um, it's super easy to get to because uh, 10 Draft Champions wins um, isn't, isn't that hard. So um, Important to note that these, that these elite players are no optional trade. They are no optional these trade. These are. Uh, but again, like super, super valuable to just again just get your team off the ground, especially big, at launch. Big, big deal. Um, yo, Cassis, yo, Cassis, who made who made that set cover art? I don't know. It doesn't look familiar. It, I did. Wait, uh, you made that? That was you. Go. All right. Yeah. It's a little more cowbell, but it's all right. I it's guess. It's flashy. It's great. <laughs> Very flashy. You were <laughs> out, so I had to, I had to do it. <laughs> you had to so. fill it. Looks good. Looks good. Yeah. All right, Billy. Yeah. All right, Billy. Awesome. Did you make that in paint? 
Would you make that? I'm proud I'm to sorry. say. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shots have, fired. I, I have seen f shouts fired. Shout I see what you did there. <laughs> yeah. But uh, I've seen Photoshop and Billy. I do Photoshop. Use it. Okay. All right. So All right. there is Billy Art in the I game. I do Photoshop for, for everybody. Look at that. Billy Art in the game. <laughs> what they need to see is. Joe Art. Joe Art. That's right. paint. That's the world. Paint. That's quality. That's not ready. That's confirmed. That's, that's confirmed. Pencils. Yeah. It's ahead of it's ahead of its time. Paint. No, but yeah. we don't we don't let that. Yeah. No, that's that's, that's in the. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's unreleased. Your, your job would be in jeopardy if they yeah. that sort of stuff. So. I, I'd be out of a job maybe. All right, um, we're going to these guys. So, yeah. So the next step. So after you get the double elite player pack uh, out of the draft champions, if you can collect a hundred draft champion badges, which is a hundred draft champions games that you got to win. Uh, you have your choice of, of any of these studs that uh, we've got here. We've got Adrian Peterson, we've got Crabtree, we've got t <laughs> we've got Pat Pete. That's, that's so good. That's a fan, that's a that's fan so favorite. That's a fan favorite. That's a fan favorite. And then uh, Pat Pete. Uh, yeah, big deal. And then uh, Suggs. Suggs. So, uh, t Sizzle. And these guys are auctionable tradable. So yes. these guys are. Um, so once you sort of, uh, once you get the, the the first double elite player pack and you kind of just get your get your team off the ground, then you have a kind of have a long term goal within it's draft champions to get one of these guys. Um, super cool. These guys are awesome. I don't know if you know any of these cool stats off the top of your head. Well, I don't know if you have a favorite here. I don't. I don't. Do you have a pro tip here for what? what I don't have you? a pro tip here. Uh. <laughs> I, I, here's the thing. Just looking I love at pass them. Rushers, so I'd go with him first. Yeah. But that's me. I would say the two guys you target. Just, I mean, I don't know any of the range, Speed. actually. I'd go look, like at Peterson and Suggs. They're, they're going to be the two, like. Like, Crabtree's going to be a possession style guy. I mean, I'm, I would imagine he's not going to have breakaway speed. Uh, AP's pretty serious. You'll be but good. You have other good right. bruising running backs. Correct. All right, but I'm willing to bet everybody is is gonna say Tebow. Tebow. <laughs> Let, let's hear a chat. Number one. Chat. Let's hear number Tebow. one Tebow. for Tebow. Tebow. Two oh, for Tebow. Else. One for Tebow. Eggbow. Two for everything else. That's let's, right. Let's if you want, if you go for Tim Tebow, type one in the chat. Anything else, type two. I mean, type two doesn't even matter. We know you're typing. One, 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 one! <laughs> exclamation mark. Exactly. <laughs> that was also a, a Madden 13 thing. Was Eggbo? That's right. right? Eggbo for for. That's not, That's not happening. That's not happening. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> Moving along. A lot of ones, guys. A lot of ones. All right. The coolest part about our game is our legends list this year. Let's oh go. my Dun, word! Da, da. All right. How many? Seven how much have you guys shown? We haven't. We we were saving this for you guys. Wow. We were saving wow. this for you guys. So you guys, oh, here you go. The juicy breaking details. Breaking news. When it feels oh like breaking, boys. All right. Oof. So these are not all. These guys are new. Did this year. Um, at least what you're looking at right now. These guys, he was in tw he was in 25, Fitter was 25. He's 6'5". 6'5". 6'5", not 6'6". Six, six. Trust six, five. Guys, trust us. He sees all your tweets when you say, Hey, Billy, man, I'm sorry. The guy yeah. is 6'1", 3 quarters. Yeah. Sure. He sees all that. He does. He does. He he's, sees all that. And he's 6'5". <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Joe Horn, awesome. That he, He's new. Okoye is a bruiser. We have him at fullback. Um, I know, I know, I know, I know. He played some halfback during the uh, during his time in the Chiefs. He was also a big time, a big time guy for them. Rushed over a couple thousand, uh, over a thousand yards for a couple seasons. Um, we, you might see a running back version of him this year, but not at launch, not at launch. Uh, Dawson, Shannon Sharp, Walter Jones. He's back from Man 25. Randall, Elway, Brooks, and then the new guy is TD. Um, I will say, uh, can we like say like who's not included? So people who are not included in Legends this year. Are uh, Otto Graham, he's gone. Blanda has gone. Marino, basically all the all the slow QBs who you can't run with ever, are okay. are, are gone. That's fair. There you go. Boom. Derek Brooks. Yeah, Derek Brooks. Big shout out. All right, I want to want to drop one more name. You want to spoil some some cool guy this year? That Michael Stray hands coming to mutt. Yes. Woo! All right. I yes. can't. Round of applause. Science fans. I can't wait to do that one. Just Michael Strahan's coming. Do you, have, do, you, do you have a vision? Do you and have Brian, a vision? Not what? yet. No it'll, vision. It'll yet? come to me. It'll and come Brian to me. Dawkins is coming back. What? Who who said that? <laughs> All right. So yeah. All right. Boom. Look at that. Moving, moving along. Uh, this is a new category. Redemption category. That new new. This uh, area is really for. Um, there's more specific things. We're going to have to communicate out when uh, special sets are released. They'll be found in the Redemption set. But it's, uh, this, is the, this is the area you'll find um, seasoned veterans right there. Uh, you get any type of Seasons Pro collectibles. I know you guys hated Legacy last year. We get you. We got it. Um, it's a little bit, little bit easier now this year. Um, every single milestone reward, you will get a Seasons Pro collectible in Head to Head Seasons. You get 10 of those, bring them right here to Season Vets. Um, who's in who there's a couple of players in here 
Oh, snap. I think Mike Vick's in here. Ooh. I think, I think, Sounds I think, right. I think yep. Eagles Mike. Eagles Vic? No, no. I'm uh, sorry. Eagles Vic is a flashback. You're right. So keep doing those flashback sets. We've been, uh, we've been making a lot of these lately, so <laughs> they're all blurring together. They're all blurring together. It's all we'll, right. We'll get you guys a list. Anyway, important thing here is that when you, when you get your 10 Seasons Pro Collectibles, add them to this set. From this set, you will, you will earn a, uh, an Elite Season Veteran Player, and more importantly, you will earn a Seasons Master Collectible. Seasons Master Collectibles go into... Okay, you guessed it, Mutt Master. <laughs> wait, wait, but... But what's the reward in Mutt Master? Uh, I wish I wish we had it. Oh, can we get someone magically to? There send they it? are. Seasons <laughs> Master Clusters. Oh, so we need ten of these in here, and then psh, you're on, you are on your way. Yeah, in this uh, out of this Mutt Master, you, you're rewarded similar to last year with the uh, cover athlete. You're getting an OBJ 999 overall with 102 spectacular catch. Um, wow. Yeah, he's on he's on my team upstairs. Wow. He's, he's pretty dirty. And I think that without you know without breaking out the calculator, but I know that you know we the, the Mutt Master last year was very 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 yes. hard to complete, and this yes. year I think once people see it, they'll be um, they'll be pleased to see that it's it's a lot easier to complete. It's not it's not something you're going to finish in a day. But no, it's going to be something that it's, you people are going to feel is attainable. So I think people are going to be excited about that for sure. Yeah. And you will be a Mutt Master. And well, okay, because because they're uh, while the player value, in my opinion, is still very strong, and he's still an incredible. Uh, he's a very good guy, good player. The coin reward is different. Because of the um, less time required to engage to earn all these things, uh, you're not going to love it, but uh, we cut the coin reward in half because we halved how much time it should take you to finish this. So Mutt Master is not, that, is not Mount Everest to climb. It's just like the Appalachian Mountains. Okay. <laughs> is that good? Mount McKinley. Sure, sure. Uh, yeah. maybe, pretty, maybe Mount McKinley. Like, it's a pretty big mountain. Okay. But, all right, you know. all right. Word, 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 word. <laughs> That was a really good analogy. Thank you. Seems legit. Right? Okay, teamwork. <laughs> All right, seasoned veterans. Uh, Pro pack. So last year, you guys will remember that um, late, late in the year, late in the year, we released uh, collectibles, pack collectibles, into packs as kind of a bonus. So when you were pulling X amount of packs and uh, a nice Pro pack collectible drops into your drops into your uh, open new items, you can redeem that here and get your bonus Pro pack. Um, that's one thing, and these are lo these are loyalty things. I can't quote on these too much. If you guys want to elaborate, but I don't. Yeah, well, basically, <laughs> it's just. Uh, Thank you for playing. Once you uh, get the uh, one of the loyalty collectibles that you got from last year's game, you plug them in this year, and th these are all different things that you can get for for this year's game. So an alt offensive, defensive player upgrades, uh, contract packs. So these are just rewards that you can redeem for coming in from. Playing last year's game. It's also Billy Art, if you don't if you don't notice. That's also That's, Billy Art. This is true. So obviously Billy Art. That wow. Billy Dude. Art. Dude, really I'm gonna good. be out of a job here soon. Question really. it. Come on. That's not me. That's did all right. You, did you do the? You can at you the can bottom? you can tell the quality difference. Like <laughs> it's like Billy. Yes. Oh wait, so you didn't do the? Oh, that's right. I did this oh, one. Oh, that's right. That's it's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> the last uh, category we really want to cover. All right, Style uh, Master is back. One of my favorites right here. Personal fave. Uh, the style solos, um, basically the same as last year. Uh, you're going to go through the first three games. They're going to be on rookie. They require a low level uh, style to get into. I think it's, tell me if I'm wrong, I think it's like 20, 50, 70, 90. That was our, the style requirements to get into the solo challenges as they go. Let me hop over to that right now so you can visually see that. Now, these, I, I remember last year, was it Peyton and was it Kerrigan? Were the Style Master guys? Is that, that correct? That was Phase, okay, Peyton, phase Keekly. Or was, was Keekly was the Keekly. first was round? Peyton Manning and uh, Keekly. Keekly. Those two players were so good for, for a very Honestly, long time. So, right? I mean, uh, that 95 <laughs> Keekly, that 95 Keekly was arguably one of the best linebackers in the game, for, uh, like up until like March. That's Agreed, right, it was. You know? so he was in my roster. So I feel like it took a lot of time to do it. It's too. worth your value, guys, to go out and do these. All right, all right. So I lied. It's actually ten. So we're yeah, okay. Ten. The second game requires forty of a X style. This is short pass. Uh, game three requires seven. The last game is a little different. Um, it's not a full challenge. It's a boss scenario. When we say a boss scenario, you're typically losing. Um, you're down. X amount of points, four, five, seven points, and you have to drive the length of the field and score. Um, for defensive ones, you are on defense, you have to stop, let's say, a Tom Brady's uh, epic drive. You have to stop him to earn that. Um, yeah. 
That's and right. one, one cool thing to note here is a great way to know if, if you're going into a, a moment or if you're just playing a full game is at the bottom right corner there, there's the little moment icon. I don't know if that's visible um, with, with our... It's not. With our <laughs> um, yeah, so where it says four minute quarters, uh, you'll see something there that will actually tell you it's, it's a moment or in this case it's a game with four minute quarters. If you, if, if, at the bottom right of any solo challenge, if you see a quarter length, that means it's a full game. If you see some cool little sign, that's... Which, if you hop into Journey, we can yeah, see plenty exactly. of those. <laughs> pro tip. If you'll no pro, pro tip. tip, pro tip. If you notice the bottom right of this, it literally says moment. So, yeah, that's definitely not a full game. It's a moment in time. It's a moment in time. Because I know I want to be ready if I hop into a fourth that's quarter right. situation here, yeah. run my two minute drill. That's right. So. Yeah, that's, a, that's, that's the other thing. Nobody reads. <laughs> I don't think you guys read. We work so hard on these, these friggin' descriptions. <laughs> Nobody reads. Yeah. Okay. That's why. By the way, by the way, check out these titles. <laughs> these titles Take are sweet. Go, go for, for the, the win. win. Penalty killer. Take down the curtain. Let's go. All right. That copies. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> no Don't play money. for wait, you. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go to the end. These are my names. Okay. These are my names. Is that Billiard or is that Castar? This is not Billiard. Or is that Joe Or is that Joe <laughs> Look at that, hold on. Flex chest. Charge, Charge the, the river. river. I see, see what you did there. I get it. I get all right, that. All right, all right. Philip Rivers. Because it has something to do with Philip Rivers. Let's go. All right. Okay. All right. Let's go through them. What you want. What you what? want. What? I thought that was worth. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> see what I'm saying? No points for you. Fly fast. You know, you know, go back to Casey. Cut me some flags. Can you go back, you go back to Casey? Flag. That's my favorite. This, you know what this one should have said? No points for you. This one should have said, no touchdowns for you, oh. wide receiver. <laughs> That's what it should have said. Because not one touchdown. Not one. Continue. Continue. Right. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Chief. Cut me some flack. Pretty that's sensational. Pretty that's very good. Pretty, pretty sensational. Okay, I got your... <laughs> okay. That's good. Run away. It's, it's a cardinal, cardinal rule. Very good. All right, all right. We'll, no, keep, all right this is, this guy, go. I like this. Roman for a TD. Roman for a TD. That's there pretty good. <laughs> Old-fashioned shootout. Shoot quit showing off. Hawk you down. Then master of disaster. That's a good one. That should have just said four rings. That's what that one should have said. Four rings. That's it. <laughs> or or Tom. it should say Tom Beatty. B-A-E-D-Y. <laughs> Instead of Brady, Tom is Beatty. Patriots suck. <laughs> no, they're really good. <laughs> they're really good. It sucks that they're really good. All right, important note, um, at the very end of the, your entire NFL journey, you will be getting a, two things, two things of note. One, a 90 overall James Winston uh, rookie player. All right. Yeah. Um, we're based on, you know, as he starts his NFL journey, you can earn his uh, elite card by completing the journey process. Um, the second thing that you will receive after completing all your NFL journey is obviously a journey master collectible. That is a huge part that um, you'll need to add to the Mutt Master set for the end goal. And when you get that done, you have a, you have a lot of, you have a, you have, I would say you have at least a third of the Mutt Master completed if you can get that in. All right, let's go back to the sets real quick. Absolutely. And I saw in there Gauntlet. Oh, Gaunt oh, well, well, oh we're going to get to that? We'll get okay. There. We'll get there. That's a little way <laughs> you know to you know make some, okay. uh, some, you know uh, okay. Some, okay. some coin. We'll go back. We'll go, coin we'll go back. Right there. It's all about that coin. Coin grind. That's it. Yeah, Scarlet was definitely a fan fave uh, and last why, year. And why was it a fan fave? I mean, for people that don't know, I mean, the Gauntlet was introduced last year, uh, what, I would say the middle of the season roughly, right? That was right around the middle of the year mm -hmm. in terms of the Madden type season, right? So talk a little bit about what's so important about the Gauntlet. Joe's got it. No, man. You I got it. it. I got yeah. it. All right. All right. All right. So, Gauntlet last year, um, what we did was I think we had a full stream of all 32, all 32 teams with the last game uh, versus the Legends. I think I'm right on that one. Uh, the first eight games were on Rookie. Second eight was Pro. Mm -hmm. The third eight was All Pro. Eight, the last All Man, blah, blah, blah. Um, the great thing about this is that the, the rewards, because it was such a grind for you, we were able to justify awesome rewards and awesome coin rewards for all of your grinding. So... Obviously a huge fan favorite. We brought it back this year. It's going to be a little bit different. Um, as you can see, we have four ready for you at launch. Um, the gates aren't on. That's a thing. Uh, but there's one at each, at each difficulty this time. So as far as last year, we had them scaling with difficulty within the gauntlet, meaning the 888. This year, right at launch, we're going to have four. And each one is going to be all against the same difficulty. So here we are at Rookie. Go for it. I was going to say, it's, it's a, uh, a small nuance, if you back out real quick, sorry. Small nuance. Oh, nothing on the screen, nothing on the screen, look away, nothing. Whoa, what's that? Whoa! <laughs> a small nuance. It's almost small like a things, guys. Right small there. nuances <laughs> matter. You know, this is something new. This adds more depth to get you a quicker understanding of what this actually is. You can see it's going to pop up. So, 
I mean, you guys can talk to that, but it's just more information. The it's more information that you care yeah. about. It's basically when when you, when somebody's on a certain uh, solo category and they've been on long enough because they've been reading, which is rare. They've been reading and they're trying to figure out what it is. An extra little pop up will will come up and help you out, help you decide what to play. Small details, guys. See that? Small details. These guys pay attention. Little the things, small details. Little things matter. All right, continue, matter. continue. All right. So anyway, very simple. Four gauntlets, each, all of them at the same difficulty. Obviously, a rookie difficulty, we're gonna have low coin rewards. It builds up to get bigger. Um, same thing with pro, it, get, it goes on. They're all on pro difficulty, all on all Madden, all on all pro. But, but, key thing, during the season, starting in October, we're going to be releasing uh, monthly gauntlets. And those gauntlets, the monthly gauntlets, October, November, we're gonna go all, we're gonna go all the way to February or March. Um, those gauntlets, will be the ones from last year. Those will be the ones with the accelerated rewards, um, the broken up into difficulty type of thing. And the important thing here is you're going to want to complete all these gauntlets during, during the year. And I will tell you why. Please tell me why, Billy. All right. So go ahead and knock all those out. All man's going to be tough, in my opinion, um, to knock out at least at launch. Um, knock all those out at launch and then try and stay on top of the uh, gauntlets we release monthly because we have this set gauntlet master do <laughs> boom boom so there are 10 collectibles in here complete all get all complete every single gauntlet you're gonna get a ton of coin rewards and rewards along the way this is kind of more felt to be as a bonus um each each gauntlet we release will give you plenty of rewards within it lots of coins but if you stick around all year with us and you keep grinding, you keep playing, you keep putting in that work, um, you're going to get a gauntlet collectible after each one. You put 10 in here, and you're going to get a 99 overall beast mode Marshawn Lynch. Ooh. Sick beast art. mode. Ooh. Sick art. Beast mode. The art is sick. Uh, God, I wish I could tell you the specific stats, but it's got to be 100 plus trucking. Anyway, he's a monster. You're going to want to do that. That's a, that's a good pro tip there. To, that's, because if, if we didn't talk about that, how would anybody know? See, that's that's why you. Come, here for? That's why you come into the stream right here, guys. You're finding out all those small details. Uh, and uh, what else? You got anything else for us? A, a small detail that would matter to anybody? Like the 99 Marshawn Lynch? Actually, this bad <laughs> oh, boy, just right? Just hanging out. Just hanging out. Yes. Yeah, so if you want to talk about it on the 50, and then we can use this as maybe a segue. We can start talking about some of the stuff we'll be doing uh, for like, uh, on, on the on like the new type of stuff we'll be releasing every day. Awesome. As, as the season goes. Yeah. Through. Okay. Cool. Um, so a quick breakdown before Joe takes us into, into our, our, our weekly, our weekly uh, content, our weekly content plan. Uh, on the 50, obviously most of you know, or a lot, all of you should know, that uh, this season is the 50th anniversary of the NFL, and we're, we'll, have, we'll have actually Super Bowl L this year. Super Bowl 50. All right, so I did there. <laughs> uh, so leading up to it, Cassis has made these awesome uh, Super Bowl patches, one from every single Super Bowl leading up to this year. What's going to happen here is Super Bowls 1, Super Bowl patch collectibles 1 through 26 are going to be in packs at launch immediately, ready to go. Um, for those who have access, for those who have access, they are not in yet to my knowledge, are they? Well, they will be soon. They're not. They'll be very yeah, soon, yeah. if not. We will, we will absolutely communicate that out when they are. Um, Super Bowl patches 1 through 26 will be in packs. Starting the very Sunday after launch, every single Sunday, be sure to be sure to come in before the game starts. Just log in, in the morning and get knock out this challenge. Um, starting on Sunday after launch, every weekend we'll have a 24-hour challenge. Only 24 hours is all you got. 24-hour 24 24-hour challenge to um, beat that Super Bowl's challenge. So the very first week will be Super Bowl 27. The following weekend, the following Sunday will be Super Bowl 28, 29, 30, all the way up till. Super Bowl Sunday is when our last uh, challenge will be dropped, and that's obviously the Super Bowl 50. Hey, we, we got a, a great question in the chat. This is coming from Ad Robs in the chat. He's, he's asking, what in your opinion, and you said this a little earlier, what is, what's, say, the first thing that someone should do when they jump into Mutt this year? What's the first thing they are, like a plan of attack? Like, all right, day one, this is what you should focus on. You should do these type of challenges, do the NFL journey, yada, 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 whatever that is in, in, in your opinion. Yeah, it's probably the first thing you do is you'll have your objectives list this year. You'll yep. want to do that again, first off. Um, something we haven't talked about, and I think we'll, we'll, um, we'll let people discover, but there's, there's more objectives than there were last year. So once you complete your first two lists, um, keep an eye out. There'll be more stuff to do objectives-wise. So that's a pretty cool thing, and there'll be, uh, it won't be hard objectives either. It'll be super short and easy stuff to, to, to win on. So 
Keep Can you give an example? So, uh, uh, pass for 200 yards. Yeah. Stuff like that. In a game. Very cool. Uh, stuff like that. So. Uh, again, super easy stuff, and so keep an eye out for that. That'll be a thing that people can do when they get into money. Great way things. to reel in some rewards, too. Yeah. I'm all about rewards. Yeah. And, then, and then along with that, it's, it's journey. Those yeah. are the two big things. So. And then um, from the journey, it was, uh, do the journey. You're going to run through that, get you uh, from there like a set, though. Let's, like, what's a, you were saying the set, which was the, what was it, the bronze and silver? Was it the bronze and silver set? Well, that was something to focus on, or you were saying the first dump set, your players in there? We're going to walk you through your first gotcha. set completed. And that's going to be the ultimate team kickoff set, quote okay. unquote. Um, at the very start of the game, you're going you're gonna to get a welcome pack. Open that thing up. You're going to want to open up the welcome pack. That's a part of the uh, first objectives list that you'll see. Mm -hmm. The best plan of action for real is to go through the first two levels of the objectives list. You're going to want to knock those out. It's an easy 3,000 plus coins and some players to just get yourself going. Uh, definitely knock that out first. And then for sure... For sure, play the first game in NFL Journey because you're going to want that Dry Archer. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Dry <laughs> Archer, Silver Player, screens all day. <laughs> Pro tip. Pro tip. Pro all tip. day. Billy Mutt tips. Do you, do you want to switch this over to, to some pack openings? Uh, uh, I've been do dying it. open Let's, packs. Let's do it. I've been dying open packs, Joe. Right. So send it over to Adele. I'm going to rip some packs right here. I got some. I got, I'm got. i feeling good. I'm feeling real oh, good right now. you have control here on the... Oh, on the packs? Oh, yeah. I'm feeling good. All right. Here it is. I'm going to rip a pack. See some magic, man. Let's see it. You know, uh, Mike Wallace, that's, that's not bad. I believe 91 speed. Oh, wow. So 6 feet, 91 speed. Mm. His jump's not there where I need him to be, but spectacular catch, 92. That's pretty Catching good. Traffic's a little, little suspect, but it's all right. It's, that's a, right. It's a, it's a solid gold. Absolutely. It's a solid gold. As I'm opening packs, Joe, you want to talk a, a little bit about what that weekly content plan, uh, things that you've done in the past, where you want to go oh, with wait. things, and whatever that might be. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before, yeah. You, before you go into that, um, stop everything. Stop right now. No, no. Okay, so I know a lot of people loved completing the sol the style solos and getting those guys and um, getting those elite coaches, blah, blah, blah. Um, there are, I think, 20 silver and bronze players in packs at launch that have an accelerated style. They're kind of Easter eggs. They're just out there. Um, so be on the lookout for those guys if you're trying to unlock a certain, if you're trying to unlock a certain um, level at the style solos. Look for those guys, man. Look out for those guys because those will, those will give you a nice boost to unlock some stuff pretty easily. Is that the Hester from last year? The, is that the? Is it? It looks see, like that's, the, looks that's like the part same. Image. Of, that's part I, of the fun of this. Yeah, right? Sometimes that's the you're Hester from see, last year. That's right. That's I, right. I, I swear that's the, I, the prime the, time. I, I haven't his, seen uh, that, and I saw it, and I was like, I'll see that's, that, "That's the Hester from. Uh, uh, that's the kickoff Hester. The that is. Or, 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 the prime return. Time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Prime time. Prime time. Yeah. Yeah. All right. By the way, in see we did there. Prime time. He beat prime time. So. That's where These it all guys. started. Labeled These guys, front. they're they're all deeper right. than you think, guys. Come Billy, on, Look Billy's got plenty up his sleeve. So many Hashtag sleeve. Billy sleeve. Let's go. What what we what got up there for this year, man? <laughs> Let's keep ripping packs. I want to give it to Joe. Joe? Yeah. He, seem, he, seems Joe to get, he seems to get elite after elite. I don't. I don't. I, I don't have that. Show me red paint. Show me red paint. I don't have that. Uh, Joe. You two, oh, you got two golds. Oh, I think I two, two Joe, give me give me day. two golds. That's not bad. I'll take two golds any day of the week. Yeah, you can get two golds in pro packs now. So guys, we've got seven minutes left uh, before we get into the gameplay portion that yeah, we have. Uh, the very first thing I would say uh, before we jump into any more questions here is we have EA Access available tomorrow, guys. You're able to play Madden NFL 16 uh, early. You'll have 10 early. hours on Xbox One to be able to play. Uh, pro tip on that, make sure you turn your Xbox off when you're... Uh, Two gold again. You know, just turn it off so that your, your ticker doesn't run, right? So don't forget that EA Access to check that out. Also, uh, oh, another housekeeping thing. We said before, if you have one of these things, uh, okay, do you okay. guys all have one of these? You have you have phones. A cell phone. Oh, do you guys oh, have cell phones. Oh, yeah. Oh, Everyone yeah. in the chat, do you guys hey. have cell phones? Because cool. you mm -hmm. might have heard a little thing called Madden NFL Mobile. It's out. You can go check that out. You can play it on Android. You can play it on iOS. I know where you're going with that, but nice. <laughs> Madden NFL Mobile available. Go check that out, guys. Now, yeah, hit that, hit last that. couple uh, minutes here we have before gameplay. Yeah. Is there anything else you guys want to talk about other than Byron Maxwell being a stud? We can talk really quick just about the, the, the stuff we be doing on a day-to-day -day basis around. So yeah. we talked about please. We've talked a little bit about uh, I mean, team of the week will, will be a cool thing. Um, we've got a really cool program this year where um, again we want to make sure. Uh, oh shoot, I, I backed out. I messed up. I good. Back. Um, uh, I don't. Know, I can't. I can't multitask. It's difficult. Here. Hey, Maybe under it's... under the lights on national live internet, Let's go. anything can happen. That's <laughs> right. Go, yeah, so, go ahead and preach. So basically, we've got. Uh, so we have Team of the Week. That's a cool thing we are coming back this year. We're going to have, uh, 
every every week we're going to have uh, again no promises, but I think most weeks we're going to have uh, uh, a challenge up where people will be able to play it. And I think you'll get a massive contract reward. So basically, a, a, a oh, short experience where people can go in and get a bunch of contracts. So if you're ever short on contracts, there should always be something around for you to get contracts. So you're not feeling like you're uh, like you're hurt on your team to be able to play games. That's a super big deal. Um, some of the cooler um, bits that we've got going on this year is we've got uh, uh, our buddy Adam Schefter is helping us out with with, uh, with some stuff. We're, uh, right. we're highlighting a player that uh, that Adam uh, thinks is a cool and upcoming star. Uh, it's similar to our Rising Star program last year, but it's uh, again like, uh, if you if you follow like Adam Schefter on Twitter, it's going to be really awesome. It's really cool. Um, it's, it's sort of uh, themed around him. Uh, what else do we have? We've got a uh, coin up's uh, back. Coin up coin is back. Up. Um, I think oh. I think for the people who played it last year, um, you know that you've got your your second coin up item for playing the second game revolved around certain things happening in whatever the prime time game yeah. was. Uh, but this year we have to be able to choose uh, what your second item is. Be used. last year you got a random draw on it, so this year you have to choose. Um, uh, good call on your part. I mean, yeah, if part, guys, so. if uh, for those who are. Um Familiar with coin up last year, we kind of the second game gave you a pack that gave you one of a what we call the wild card. Yeah. Um, there are basically there are basically situations that if they happen in Sunday night football, uh, quick sell the, the, the next morning or the next day for X amount of coins. I think we had a fifty thousand, seventy five thousand hit last year. Do we have a hundred thousand? That's hit? awesome. I don't know. So quick, I don't know, quick question in the chat, and you are just talked about this, but uh, Lax or Mac is asking. Uh, are you going to do anything similar to Rising Stars? And you were, you were, were just talking about that. Again, that's, just let yeah. them know. So. That's right. Yeah, yeah so, so that, was, that was the Adam Shepard stuff. Yeah, yeah about, so yeah. great. So yeah, see so yeah, how that's, that's something that they are, will be uh, yeah. looking forward to. Rising Schefter. Stars is back. We're just re-labeling it Shefter Stars because yep. we have a nice partnership with them now. Yep, absolutely. It's cool to have that insight on top of that for that program. Shefter Stars. Shefters. Shefters. Uh, we talked about on the 50 already for a bit. Yeah, um, Sunday Sundays are important. Be sure to be sure to come in Sunday morning before the game start and knock out those those uh, on the 50 solos. So you can get that. Uh, oh, that's important. The reward for on the 50. Um, those are the Sunday 24-hour challenges. Come back each week. He was up on the, yeah right there. Of course, not on the screen right now. But it's 99 overall Super Bowl MVP edition Steve Young. Um, that's a big time guy. He's probably already on on. Uh, I don't know. I've seen uh, Mobile's um, pictures uh, reveal his art, but he's pretty ill. I don't really know. I don't have. I've gotten elite yet, so I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> I want to get back to you because you have you have all Let's the luck it. here. Come on. All, right, all right, let me go one more, one more, one more. Dang. Well, this cost is, Christian. You haven't gotten any. Like you haven't opened any. So all right, here we go. Off to him. Master, Master, football, ball me. Master right here. Ball right. me, blazer. Catch. No pressure. Ooh, one handed. All right. All right, Billy. All right. I swear I used to play. <laughs> Once upon a time. Go Hoos. All right, let's see what we got here. Something really cool I've noticed is um, we, we we have the closed and open stadiums to look cool. for. Yeah. I really like that. It was really fun to work on that. Kobe. All right, all right, here we go. Give me something. Give me something. I'm gonna go on this one. What up? I'm on Gronk. You're on. You're on OBJ. Oh, uh, Gronk. Yo, we got any more OBJ. questions? Hold up, though. <laughs> All right, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not reading too well. <laughs> All right, look that. Are we? Are we out of time? What's up, Billy? What's up? What's up, How's man? Going? What's up, Joe? What's going on, man? How you doing? What's up, Cassis? What's going on, man? Uh, I'm let's, just hopping in see, here. Kind of pack luck. Been watching. Pack oh, luck let's see. Let's see what I got. Gibbs has had the best luck today, so far. <clears throat> so, what do you guys? What do you guys do? Left to right? You just general left to right? People have like make the, sure, make the sure method. You make sure you marry. <laughs> you got to marinate Crucial. the packs, <laughs> and there's a secret code of like the stick. order. In which you up, got, up, no, down, down, no. BA, yeah, select, start. Just kidding, guys. <laughs> yeah, no, there's not. Clowny. 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 Okay. He needs to get healthy. He needs to get healthy. Guy that Texans defense is something serious. Yeah, it is. If they can keep, it, if they can keep it together. How about Branch? Is he like? Cushing, Watt, Wilford, Clowny. Jeez. 91 speed. Let's go. A little hidden strong. gem in there. Safety. Hidden yeah. gem in there. Uh, 74 hit power. I'll take it. Yep. All right. 
I'm going to real, say goodbye. Thank you guys for joining us. Uh, this is Madden Ultimate Team. We are not done playing this today, obviously. Um, do one last pack here, and then we're going to bring the gameplay guys on. Rex Dixon. We've got RG over there. Uh, Larry Rehart. That's not bad. Chandler Jones. Wow. No, I'll take that. I think I did pretty well. You did, right? you did, you did pretty well. No elites. Just like that? No elites. You build a solid lineup yeah. around some of these guys here. Mm. All right. Well, thank you guys for joining us. And if you want to drop down later tonight, we're going to be here cool. literally all night. Sounds cool. Catch you guys later. All right, guys.